Therefore, my beloved brethren, be ye steadfast, unmovable, always abounding in the work of the Lord, for as much as ye know that your labor is not in vain in the Lord. These other churches, they have the Sunday school program. That's a failure. The Sunday school program is a copycat of the public school system. Take them from their parents, make them learn something different, let them color, let them draw, give them some candy. That's not church. Look, there's a whole generation lost in these other Baptist churches because they gave their kids up to Sunday school. And guess what? They never came back. I mean, when they got to be teenagers, they still, well, can't we have a youth church? I don't want to go out there with the adult. Hey, grow up. Be an adult. Listen to the preaching. Learn the hymns. Sing like us. Don't go in the back and sing rock music. Don't go in the back and let some short-haired woman teach you. These Baptist churches that are doing that, they're, they're under a curse. They're losing their very own children, and they can't figure out why. Send them off and have somebody else train them. Why don't you take the responsibility for yourself and train your own children? God has commanded you to do it, and if you don't do it, then you're failing as a parent. And look, we're not going to fail as, as a church. We're going to let the children stay in here with us, even if they're noisy. We're going to love the children. We want them to be trained up in the Word of God. And these Christian colleges talk about failures. Who was Somebody last week was telling me about his pastor. I'm getting, I think it was Brother Owen was telling me about his pastor. You're getting really involved. And I like what you're doing. You're on fire. You're a soul winner. His pastor says, well, what you need to do is go off to Pensacola Christian College for four years. Well, then what? So, so what, the pastor is shooting himself in the foot. He's, it's like a, a self-destruction. Wow, I've got somebody that's talented. They're on fire for the Lord. They know the Bible. They're a soul winner. What I want you to do is to leave us. Leave the flock. Leave the church that God established. And go to a corporation that's going to teach you strange doctrine. And then maybe you can come back and then maybe you can serve under me. How about serve right now? Look, we have more men that are active in this church than probably churches three times our size. Why? Because it's, it's, it's where your heart is. You want to be a soul winner? Do you want to be a preacher? Guess what? It's available to you.